I wish that we would have had the camera going at that point in time because the screaming, I'm sure I woke all of my neighbors up because it was craziness. Bug drama, bug, bug, bug drama. Bug drama, there's a bug in the ear. Bug drama, bug, bug, bug drama. Hey guys, welcome to Saturday. It's actually really late, it is already almost five. But we haven't been doing anything much today, just kind of relaxing. I am trying to catch up on editing because a vlog did not go up yesterday on Friday. If you're wondering why didn't you put up a vlog yesterday, Jen, it is because I was working on launching our new channel. That's right, you can now find the HTK fam in two different locations. Of course, here on the vlog channel, but we also have our new HTK Presents channel. Anything that we feel like filming that is not a vlog is going to go on that channel. Send us your ideas. Let us know what you want to see. Hayden and Glenn are getting ready to go to the movies here in just a little bit, so that'll be funny when they get home to find out how it went because, well, I'll let them tell you what they are going to see. All right, I just saw Will running around the yard with the cell phone. Let's go see what he's doing. Well, I don't know what you're supposed to do. I have to ask Hayden, are you trying to play that new Pokemon game? Can't see it. Hayden told us about the new Pokemon app where you take your phone and you search around um, everywhere apparently and you can find Pokemons. Well, I'm not a Pokemon fan, but that apparently doesn't matter because I think it sounds like the coolest game ever. Hayden's been playing it a lot around the neighborhood, so Will and I thought it was kind of cool. So we'll just download it and he's trying it out. Oh, he's on impressed. I thought it'd be so much fun next week to take all of the kids, all five of them, out and about town next week and go search for Pokemons on Hayden's phone. If you have played it, let us know in the comments below, but I think it's gonna be super exciting and fun, something fun and different to do, and a perfect way to get the kids out of the house. But it doesn't look like Will's very impressed. <laughs> the look on his face is so funny. He looks like he's like totally disgusted by it. It's not your thing. Hayden loves it though, and it'll be fun for the kids, I think. <laughs> He's not impressed. I don't know where any of the kids are. Hayden is, it looks like the girls are over at the neighbor girl's house and nobody asked me if they were allowed to go over there and play and I'm not exactly thrilled with that. Hey girls, girls, Tara, why didn't you guys tell me you were going over there? Daddy knew? All right. They told Will. It's supposed to be dressed up. No, it's there's, a movie. There's, you might find girls. That's what I'm thinking. You know, those girls. Cool. You always gotta be prepared. You never know who you're gonna run into. Alright. Where are you going? Purge See the purge. Yeah. You're yeah. seeing what? The purge. No way you approve that with me. Yeah, huh? <laughs> who do you think between the two? Glenn? Yeah. <laughs> or Hayden is gonna scream like a little girl. Uh, I got money on me. I get, oh, I get terrified. <laughs> are you being serious or sarcastic? So, I'm, being, I'm being sarcastic. Okay. Being <laughs> you sound like you're being serious. Uh, I'm gonna be up all night worrying about the purge. Wait for that tone. You have your shoe lifts so that way they don't ID you. Make you look taller. Your fake beard, your fake ID. <laughs> he's, he's actually 26. He's aged very well. <laughs> Just yeah. He got my family's jeans. Yeah, he's got his mom's height. Alright, <laughs> see you guys. See you guys. Have fun. Peace. Be good. They're off to go see the purge. I don't know about this. We have to kind of just let go and realize that my baby's not a baby anymore. And I'm getting ready with this new backdrop to film the next. Actually, it won't be the next. It will be the HTK Presents that goes up on Thursday. I mean, Friday. They go up on Tuesdays and Friday. So this will be the HTK Presents that goes up on Friday. Got my camera set up. I'm not gonna show you what's in the bag. I don't wanna give it away. All right, I'm all done filming. I just about lost the light, so I'm glad I finished up when I did. How's your movie? Good. Good? I really, I really Did you cry? I, no. Did Glenn cry? Yes. I did. I had to leave you the theater a couple no. times, yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I keep leaving uh, you. Someone got awfully scared during the previews, though. Why, what happened? Freaky it's for the uh, movie, what was it, Ouija? Yeah. Oh yeah, I don't know. And then there was another one, Lights Out. Like it was like that kind of like 
grab you from like out of the corner of the screen. Did you scream like a crazy person? No, but I looked over. That'd be a good movie <laughs> if it was in 3D, huh? Uh, oh, yeah. If you want people to be on the seat. Definitely a good movie, though. Worth uh, recommending to... Children of all ages. Not children of all ages, <laughs> you know. I would definitely... The language and the graphic, but it wasn't nothing. Like, you know, he's not used yeah. to, but... How did you think, though, Hayden? You like it, though? Yeah, I really liked it. Probably one of my favorite movies. Oh, wow. Good deal. All in all, though, definitely a good movie. Yeah. Good. I'm glad. What's up with you? Are you cold? It's hot out here. No, we'll turn the fan down. No, you don't have to. No. All right. I'm going to take a bath. Good. Did you just think I can all the way over here? No. Are you having major FOMO? Do you know what that means? Mm -hmm. Wow. Take a look at you being all hip. Will's, like, motorcycle group, his gang. It's not a gang. I know. <laughs> I know it's not a gang. His little motorcycle group, uh, Shadow Riders, are all in Colorado doing a big ride. So it's, like, their annual trip, and he's not able to go. So he's watching it. They're doing, like, a Facebook Live thing tonight, so he's watching that. It's going next year. Must in Alaska. Must in Alaska. That wouldn't be good. What if it's in Hawaii? I don't think you can ride a motorcycle in Hawaii. You can ride motorcycles in Hawaii. Not to Hawaii. Oh yeah, not to Hawaii. I just had to take a shower because I was sitting here just starting editing and I felt like a bug go in my ear. So at first I was just like thought it like flew in and flew out, but I was like, ah, oh, bug in my ear. But then I realized that everything sounded a little bit muffled. And then I heard the buzzing. It was inside of my ear, like buzzing or moving or something. I don't know. I freaked out. I jumped up. I started shaking my head, like trying to get out like you'd be shaking water out. And I think at that point in time, I killed it because I didn't feel any more buzzing after that. I shoved my head underneath the kitchen faucet, poured water in my ear. Um, I could still feel it in there. Like I could still feel like the muffledness of it. The same thing actually happened to Tara last year at my mom's house. Didn't it, T? Mm hmm And how did you get the bug out of your ear when you were at Grammys? I took a shower. Yeah. I wanted to get in the shower so badly. I took off running, and Will comes after me. He's like, let me see if I can help you. So he comes with a pair of tweezers, like he's going to pull the bug out with tweezers. And I'm like, don't stick tweezers in my ear. You're going to push it in there further. So I jumped to the shower, and then I just, like, let the water just, like, spray in my ear forever. So I think I have, like, two gallons of water that just ran through my eardrum. But I'm not 100% sure that it's out. Like, it still feels funny, but I think that that might just be because I had a bug in my ear, and it was so traumatizing. And then also I put, had so much water go in my ear. There's probably some water in there. But it doesn't really feel muffled, so I'm sure that it's out. But I never saw it come out, so I don't know. I'll I'm probably scared. always be scared there's a bug in my ear. I'm scared but now. Why are you scared? This. <laughs> You're making sure the bugs don't get in your ears? Yeah. I've never, I've got a bug in my ear, but it just flew right out. I think the bug is alive in my ear. Oh, no. You think? Yeah. I could feel something in my ear. It could possibly be water pouring out, but will you hold a flashlight up to my ear and see if anything crawls out? Because I could feel something moving in my ear. I mean, I could feel something, but it might just be water. Tara, go run to the hallway closet and grab me a Q-tip. Here we go. Will's gonna save me. Look, you can see this light coming out this side. <laughs> That's not nice. Because, I mean, I think that if the bug is alive, it will crawl towards the light. Because that's how I watched this video one time in Sorry or something. I don't know if it was a video or a movie. I think it was a video. Somebody had a snake in their ear. Ew, what? Or like a. Uh, no, it wasn't a snake, it was a leech. Oh, ew. What? I'm pretty sure that was from a movie. I don't remember what that was. But they held the light Oh, you know what? That was on Grey's Anatomy. <laughs> Do you see anything? It feels like if it's there, it's like towards the front. It might just be the water. The breaking news out of Dallas today. And I'm going to try to talk about this without crying. Um, it's hit me very, very hard. Are you going to get a new brother or sister maybe soon? I think you're going to. We'll see. 